Welcome everyone, how are you today? Sorry I didn't do a video yesterday. I wanted to thank everyone that purchased readings on New Moon. I was highly touched. The compliments were extremely awesome. Um, it just it felt great to get some positive feedback from complete newbies that came in the front and that was really awesome. I'm really happy that you guys were very satisfied with your readings. So in saying all that, today is Friday. Happy Venus Day. I will be doing a two-card reading today. We're on June 2nd, so it's two. Um, the first card today, actually, Earth Magic Man pulled. So he's going to be pulling the, from the Earth Magic deck, and I will be pulling mine from the Angel Tarot. Okay? So his is Clouds. I'll get into that once I pull this one. Okay? Here we go. takes a second, sorry. <laughs> okay. Knight of Earth. <laughs> this is awesome. Okay, Knight of Earth. This describes someone with dark hair, darker eyes, someone that is very loyal, very dedicated. They are very honorable and kind. This is a time to buckle down and get things done. Honor your commitments. A guardian angel is near. So that makes a complete lot of sense, especially when it goes hand in hand with the clouds. Because with the clouds, this one is telling you to make sure that you get a grip on yourself. Like how clouds constantly shape shift. And I'm like a chameleon, chameleon if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, like how to be able to, you know, change from environment to environment. Um, it's about reinventing yourself. Um, has the storms passed? Are you, a, you know, a billowy cloud floating? Are you changing into bigger or other clouds forming with you stuff of that nature which makes sense with this card to be in the night this can also symbolize to females also it's just a general reading it just it's shocking how it goes side to side because this one's all talking about reinventing yourself and this one talks about buckling down so in a nutshell you know this weekend just work on being you never sacrifice something or anything of yourself to stop yourself from being exactly who you truly are. <sighs> they didn't call me lonely liquid girl for nothing. Sometimes you have to walk alone for a while before you come across right paths of other people where it actually kind of weaves together, stitches together like a nice quilt is the best way I can describe it. So, Or it can end up being just a patch from a good night on the back of your jean jacket. So. I hope that made sense for you all. Peace, love, and light. Namaste. Continue to have a rocking day. And I will see you guys on Sunday for your elementary dice reading. Peace.